Good morning, y'all. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Hannah, and this is a get ready with me on a layover. This is like my 10 minute makeup routine that I use every single day, especially for those early mornings when I'm headed to work. I try to sleep as long as I can and I wake up and then I try to knock this out as quick as possible. Obviously this video, it'll be a lot longer. Just going through and explaining to you guys what everything is and just kind of talking you through it. The more you do it, the quicker it just becomes. And also there are definitely things that you can eliminate from this that you don't have to have. All right, y'all, I'm just putting this out there. Full disclaimer, these products that I'm using are not cheap. I am bougie when it comes to my makeup and I try a lot of different things. This is what I've been using for the past couple of months. I start with, this is a Bobbi Brown primer. It's expensive, yes. And I can't decide if I like it or not. I love the way this feels, but I've been breaking out lately. So I don't know if it's this or something else. And I like the way it smells. It's the, it's vitamin enriched face base and I always use it before putting on my makeup. <laughs> I'm also very festive. This is Charlotte Tillsbury? Tills Tillsbury? I don't know what her name is. Charlotte something. This is Airbrush Flawless. And I will say, I have actually bought this three times now. And that is very rare for me. This is the color Cool Freud number three. And I personally think it's a little dark for me because when I got it, I had a spray tan. And that's just pure laziness of me not going to get a color match. So, always, Dampure, if you use a beauty blender, which if you're not, why? This is, I just love this thing. I always buy a new one, usually every six months to a year, because you know that can get gross. I try to wash it once a week because it can hold dead skin cells and whatnot. But yes, damp your beauty blender. I don't do anything fancy because I'm always doing this on my layover and I'm usually have a van pickup at 4.45 a.m. and I'm doing the bare minimum, but also trying not to scare my passengers. And then I kind of like dab it everywhere and then I'll go back in and blend it, but I got a big pimple right there, gotta cover that up. I just kind of go in and blend it everywhere. The only place I don't put it is underneath my eyes because I use a concealer there to like brighten my eyes and this is a heavier shade and I don't want that to drag my eyes down. I want brighter under my eyes. So I'm currently in Birmingham, Alabama. It is a gorgeous day here. I mean, absolutely stunning. It feels cool out, or it did last night. It felt really cool outside like it was fall. And our van pickup today isn't until 2 p.m., which is so rare for me. I love this life. The only, the worst thing about having those later van pickups is I get home much later. So I don't get home until like 10 o'clock on Wednesday, which stinks. But I love being able to sleep in and like take my time for the day. Cause we've got a long day ahead, y'all. We're going to Oregon tonight, so that is a five hour flight. And then it's a super short layover, so you can probably kind of see like this obviously is a darker shade because I have no self tanner on right now. And now I do a concealer under my eyes to brighten them up. This is the color Light 20B, and this stuff is my holy grail. I'm actually not a big Tarte fan. I have a few of their things, but this I continue to buy. But for work, I just kind of dab it underneath. I do like some dabs like this. And then I'll do some down here. I'm thinking about, so there's a cookout that's like a mile away. And I'm thinking about going there for lunch. Let's blend it in and brighten our eyes. And so with this, I like only put it underneath my eye and then I go around because it goes a long way. So I looked up the cookout. It's a 30 minute walk 
and we don't get picked up until two. So I was like, honestly, I don't feel bad about getting cookout because I'll walk there. It's like my little workout, eat my food and then walk it off. Fun fact, I'm obsessed with Casey Cassidy. I'm sure many of you follow her. I'm an OG, I love her. I watch all of her videos. She recommended this, it's from Amazon. I think she got it from Carrie, but this is my setting powder. One side says veil, one side says hourglass. But I really, I really like this one a lot. I've been through quite a few. It gets like in the creases really well. I'm not really picky on what bronzer and stuff that I wear. Cheek Duo, and it's like a bronzer and then a blush. I like it for the convenience. But it, it works, like you can buy the brush, the duo, so this is for the blush, this is for the bronzer. So I just did that on there. And then I always like to do here to try to accentuate my jawline. Did it help? No. And then I always do up here. And then I just go and blend it all in. Sometimes I'll blend it down here since my face doesn't match my neck. It's looking pretty good. Feeling good about it. It's a buildable blush. So what I mean by that is like if you really like those pigmented blushes, this isn't for you. And I am not one of those people because I feel like I don't, my face is very small. So if you do too much, it just kind of drags it all down. So. I like that this one is buildable. It's very light. You just have to work up to the color that you want, but it's still gonna be pretty light on your skin. Like I said, we go to Portland tonight. We have three, no we don't. We only have two legs a day. So used to having three leg days all the time, but we actually only have uh, two legs today. It, it's gonna feel like three because going to Portland is so Such a long flight that we're gonna have two services, but it's fine. At least we only board once so I'm just going in and kind of like blending stuff. I don't really do a whole lot. Don't be too aggressive on your face Again, this is obviously not taking 10 minutes right now But in the mornings you'd be surprised at how fast I can do this the mascara I've been using let me just say, I like the brand Lancome. Like, this is probably one of my favorite brands, but I don't feel like it makes my lashes live up to their fullest potential. I feel like my lashes can be so much more, but I don't know. I think it's this brush. My Holy Grail, literally, I will always buy this. I will never go to anything else. This is like glue for your eyebrows. It is amazing. And it comes off so easily when you wash your face. Um, this stuff is so great. I love this. So this is just to like bush up my eyebrows. Don't get crazy and like start clumping it on there. Just slightly tap it. I don't know. I see models do this and I'm like, mm, I want to do that. And I went through a lot of stuff. How did I find this stuff? I'm trying to think. Oh, another YouTuber actually. That's what it was. I can't remember her name. Also, my eyebrows need some self-love. So normally I buy the Anastasia brow pencil. It's like another holy grail. I bought it for many, 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 many years. I went to CVS and I found this one that looked exactly like it. And it's the NYX Micro Brow Pencil. And it's the color Espresso. So, and y'all, it's like identical to the Anastasia one and it's like less than half the price. So I've been buying this one. I'm actually out right now. Lip liner. This was recommended to me as well. It's called Pillow Talk. I've heard a lot of people talk about this one. It's a really, really pretty color. So this is the one I use all the time. And I come in behind that with Dior and it is a it's a Dior lip maximizers 
I really like this. I actually keep this in the pocket of my uniform and put it on for my landing vest. You know, when we're about to land. Because I work such long days. I use the all-nighter. I do like this one. There's another one that I use that I have at home. It's called the Morphe. But I bring this one on my trips. I like both of them. I basically do like an X over my face and then just let that set in and dry. All right guys, so that is it. It's pretty simple. It's super easy, super quick. Definitely drop in the comments like if there's something that is your holy grail, please tell me. I go off of recommendations. I'm not one that goes searching for stuff. So if someone's like, this is good, I'm going to buy it. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. This was really fun just because I had a longer layover today and I'm about to go get dinner. No, I'm not. I'm not going to get dinner. It's 11 o'clock. Thank you guys so much for all your support. You guys have a great week. Bye.